Hi guys, today we're going to learn about an artist named Mary Cassatt. Mary Cassatt used to love to paint pictures of mothers and children. Some were her children and some were other people's children. So today you can either use colored pencils or I'm going to use crayons. What we're going to do is we're going to draw a picture of you with one of your parents. So we're going to draw a person. This is going to be your parent and this is going to be you. So you could take a skin color, whichever one you desire, and you can draw an oval for a head. That is your parent's head. Then you're going to draw an oval over here to be your head. And you're going to give your parent a neck. And you're going to give yourself a neck. And then you're going to pick a color to be what your clothing is. And you can draw a U for the neck of your shirt. And then go the opposite way to go down. And then on this side, go down. And hopefully you can see that. Okay. Now we're going to do your parents' shirt. So I'm going to move my paper over just a little bit. Okay. I'm going to give them a kind of a V. I'm having to dodge this thing here so it makes some of my stuff not work. Now this is going to go over, but don't let it go into your head. And we're going to go over to this side. So now we're going to go back to the skin color and we're going to work on people's faces. Let's work on your face first. So I've got it down where you guys can see. And remember, your eyes are not way up here. That's where your hair is. Your eyes are about halfway between the top and the bottom. So they're about halfway in the middle of your oval. So you're going to draw one eye and you're going to draw a second eye. Then you can draw a nose. And you're going to draw a mouth. Okay, so then you can figure out what color your eyes are. And I'm going to use blue because I'm going to make this be my sun vance. So I'm going to draw an eyeball and kind of color it in. And I'm going to draw another eyeball and kind of color it in. And then that white spot so he doesn't look like a zombie. I'm going to fill that in, otherwise known as the pupil. going to color that in. Then I'm going to give him some hair. Which she kind of has blonde hair, but you're not going to be able to see it if I do blonde hair. So I'm going to do some lines like that. Then he's got kind of curly hair. So then I'm going to move up to my face, which would be your parents' face. So I'm going to move this down. Remember, their eyes are still about right in the middle of that oval. So I'm going to give myself an eye. I'm going to give myself an eye. Notice that it's a frown with a smile. Then down here for the nose, I put a small smile with parentheses and lines coming down. Oh, I forgot eyebrows on him. Okay, then the mouth, you kind of do a little U and then lines to the side where it looks like mountains. Then a line going across and a line going across. And that's the mouth. Now, my eyes are brown. So, I'm going to make a brown circle. And I don't want to look like a zombie either, so I'm going to fill those in with black. Now, I want to give myself some eyelashes now 
Guys actually have eyelashes too, but if you put them on, somebody may think you're a girl. So if you feel like putting them on, put them on. If you feel like leaving them off, you can. I'm going to give myself some brown eyebrows. I'm going to skip over here and give him some too. Hopefully you can see that. Uh, you may or may not have been able to see that. Okay, so then I'm going to give myself some hair. Now, you can get fancy with this. I could put some blonde in the hair. I could give myself some blonde highlights. I can go in and give myself, okay, I only have one brown in this set of colors, I apologize. So, I might make mine a little browner. And I may give myself a little bit of makeup by giving myself some pink cheeks. And, oh, I don't want to forget. Okay, I'm going to do his mouth first. I'm just doing some regular pink. And if, it, if you're doing a guy's face and it looks like lipstick to you, take your skin color and go over it and you can kind of fade it out and it'll look more just like lips. Then over on my side, I'm going to give myself some lipstick. And if it's too bright, I can go over it with skin color. Okay, I'm going to do skin color on my face you would probably color much neater so I'm um, coloring this in and there's the neck I'm gonna do his face and then I'm going to color in our clothing, so you're going to see his shirt, and I could actually draw in more details on the shirt if I wanted to, but for video's sake, I don't want this to be too long. It also would be nice if you did a background, but I am not going to make you watch that and I don't want this video to go too long your coloring could be much neater than mine I am doing some very fast coloring just because I'm running into my stand and I don't want the video to be too long so there you go it's a Mary Cassatt parent and child picture